Hello Leo, welcome to your uh, July 2022 tarot reading. Now, uh, for those of you who are reading this video a little later, maybe the universe has brought you here so that uh, you will be able to get a specific message for you. So even if this is dated for July 2020, some of you might find your way here at a later date. Well, it's not late, it's uh, the time of the spirit. Okay, you were meant to see it at that time of your life's journey. Okay, so now let us try to arrange first the cards, put them there. Okay, another one here. Okay, so remember this is a general reading, so just take what resonates with you and leave behind what doesn't. Okay, give it to the other viewers to whom it will resonate with. Okay, uh, there's a certain beauty with this communal reading, you know. It, somehow I feel like, it's, you know, the energies, they, they sort of help each other too. Uh, like for example, some insights of one other, energy, I don't know. Somehow I feel, yeah, there's, some, there's a certain beauty with communal sharing of the reading. We are all interconnected. What affects what uh, happens to one person also affects the others, no? Especially when they are related in their zodiac signs. Okay, so generally this is your career path. Generally this is your relationship path. It can be relationship with a special someone, or a family member, or family, or your friends, or your colleagues in work, no? And then this one is generally for your inner journey, but expect that there will be some crossing overs between these cards because they are all interrelated they're all part of your life okay now we start with the career path we try to see what is the main energy that the spirit will give us spirit please give us the main energy for the career path of leo leo the lion okay leo it's time to roar to roar in your career conscious living okay <clears throat> those healthy changes you have been meaning to make are imperative for you now okay so whatever uh, plans you have for uh, working on your health no health and career is related so for some of you i think what the universe is saying hey hey guy you've been making plans on improving your health or working on your health or maybe uh and putting your health uh, a little upper in, 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 in an upper notch. You know? It's time for you to apply it, okay? You need to be consciously living. <laughs> I think I'm, it's also a message for me. I also have a Leo in one of my signs, no? And uh, yeah, I need to, yeah, we all need to, those healthy changes that you need, we have been meaning to make are imperative for us right now, okay? Okay, here, wow, we have the Lovers, we have the Knight of Cups, we have the Ace of Pentacles, and then we have the Part Five of Pentacles. Okay, for some of us, it seems that uh, yeah, you're going to undergo a tower moment. I don't know when will it will this tower moment will come, but it's a tower moment that you need to undergo. It is something that is destined by the universe. You see the stars here. It's as if the universe is uh, the universe feels that you have to undergo this one. Uh, there will be a closing in. Uh, maybe for some of you, uh, I'm sorry, no. Uh, Please don't get angry, but I feel that for some of you, you might be uh, losing your job. Like uh, they will be making you resign. Okay, it's uh, and it will affect you. Somehow it will affect you because yeah, uh, but it is something that you need to because it will lead you to something beautiful. So I felt I was felt drawn here first, no? And I feel that the direction is going this way. So I feel that uh, somehow 
uh, in your present for some of you in your present career you 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 will be uh, fired sort of like that uh, but it is uh, and you will be affected by it yeah you see here this woman is in sorrow no maybe it's because she this work is sort of her uh, she's relying on this work for her to for her survival no but there will be people who will be coming to your aid people who will help you no in this moment of loss from your career people will be helping you but there are stars in the window i feel that you need to search for an open window a door will close which is your present career but there will be windows that will open up and this will lead to success okay this will lead you to success or for some of you there will be a new inspiration that will be coming out from the spirit world and they will inspire you and this inspiration will allow you to be grounded and at the same time will you will allow you to be prosperous it will lead to progress at the same time it will set you free you see here this knight of cups is on his way to a big adventure he is opening the sails of his ship in order to go to this unknown sea and uh I don't know why there's something hiding here wait let me try to study um, suddenly it catches my attention I don't know why hmm uh-huh uh, it's not very clear no but uh, it makes me think th this is a very uneasy one here uh very not very clear but you know what i'm feeling i'm starting to feel that there's a whale there and this is a uh, water coming out from the spout of the whale no but there's no whale here in the drawing i just have this 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 gut feeling that there's a whale there for me it symbolizes the the spirit world you know the fish speaking to to the knight of cups no is it's the the fish speaking to the page of cups yes the fish speaking to the page of cups but here makes me feel that the fish is still here even in the knight of cups the fish is still here i cannot see it clearly but there is a black place there with something like coming out no it's not really a very clear picture of a whale but it makes me feel that there's a whale somewhere here hidden in the waters so i feel that not only is the spirit talking the spirit world talking to the page of page of cups in the rider weight no here we have the knight of cups no and and the knight of cups is riding a horse but in this picture he is on a boat on a galleon on a way for an adventure and i feel that he is being accompanied by a whale maybe ready to save him if he falls off the water so the whale is unseen here but somehow i have a feeling that the whale is somewhere there so it, for me it's a symbolism that the spirit world is with you and your injured guys are there to protect you and to accompany you in your journey and you are going to have this courage to open up your sails and go into a new adventure this one is setting you free this being five from your work is setting you free a new inspiration is coming to you and this inspiration promises prosperity and you are setting out on a new adventure and somewhere in the near future for some of you you will be meeting somebody i think it's a soulmate because you are attached to this these two trees have roots that are intertwined with each other you are uh, attached to this person you will be attached to this person not only in the physical sense but also in the spiritual sense and it will be a a relationship where it's you see here it's as if this the tree is dancing i feel that the relationship will make you dance in the near future okay and you will be setting out on a new adventure so this is a blessing this will open up a new venture give you a new inspiration and will lead you to success now it's quite unusual usually uh, the previous readings i read it that way but this time i felt drawn here and i found myself traveling this way it's unique you know so it seems that whatever your path you are undergoing right now it will not be 
the content the typical one you it will really be an adventure because it will be something you do not usually experience it's something new no this one is something new you are going uh, uh, this makes me it's like going against the tide it's like uh, going against the current you know you, you will be going against the current something like that uh, you will not be afraid to to follow your dreams even though it is not popular okay now let us uh, could spirit could you give us this uh, additional message for us in our career path soul searching it's time to go within and uncover your true feelings okay so whatever this door closes will lead you to spend more time reflecting on your life's direction and i think it will set you free in the near future you it will lead you to soul searching and it's time to go within yeah go within you will be spending more time discerning your career path and uncover your two feelings uncover your two feelings i think is this, for this time you will be following something that you want to do it's possible that for some of you you were working because you just needed to survive but your heart and your soul is not into it finally that you are set free the universe is giving you a chance to follow your heart and your soul the one that is burning deep inside you this new inspiration that is hidden but promises you could see already that it promises something beautiful in the future okay so that is what we see i am uh, inspired to shuffle the cards again to get the main energy for um your relationship path okay the love path okay the main energy is perfectionist okay keep your standards high and honorable but let go of the need to be perfect okay uh, i think it's the same with the relationship i mean uh, do not be too much of a perfectionist that you will not welcome people because this person that might come to you well they're not perfect i mean they're not like the usual tree that is perfect no this one is a little bit crooked <laughs> so there might be some imperfections in the person that is coming your way but if that person is your soulmate that is the best partner that you can have in this world i mean you try to see we are not also perfect to be perfectly human is to be imperfect but constantly growing okay so the same thing also you if you are also if you know that you are not perfect and you are in the constant process of growing then also look upon your partner and the people that the spirit is giving you as also in the process of towards in the journey towards perfection so expect also that they will not be perfect but don't worry no here you see uh we have the ten of pentacles this is a beautiful picture of the ten of pentacles there is a promise of you see here you finding this someone it is near here and then it's not a perfect situation because whatever your relationship you you are going to climb a spiral stairs towards your dream so it means that you will you will exert some effort in order to to make this dream come true in order to reach this prosperity that is waiting for you at the top uh, and i think you need together you need to be in the palm of the spirit you know on eagle's wings i hold you in the palm of my hand no it's uh you are in the palm of the hand of this of the divine palm of the hand of the universe of the spirit uh, the the spirit guides are also there to protect you they are holding you in the palm of their hands and they are accompanying you into in your journey towards success together with this special partner that is coming into your life you no know? uh, you have the presence of the divine this is beautiful because your love relationship journey is accompanied by the universe accompanied by the divine and the, it promises success for you and the generations to come okay and we have here the ace of swords okay so the ace of swords somehow is related to this one not the ace of pentacles no? something new is coming ace of pentacles is something that pr promises uh something that promises uh prosperity the ace of swords is something that promises new wisdom new knowledge that is what i feel and here you see the angels no? And then uh, some trees here uh it's as if they are coming from your head no so you will gain new wisdoms no new wisdom you will gain new wisdom and this new wisdom will lead you to prosperity i see house here uh, i see an angel here so it's also a, a deepening in your inner life no 
uh, this this knowledge that you will have will bring you success in the near future and it will bring you into a increase in your intuitive capacity and you feel stable it's like the sword or the knowledge you are leaning on it it will be supporting you in your journey towards this inward success and outward success also you have the eight of swords here okay so uh maybe it is because related here no uh yeah you see again it is from here going this way no let us see what is here okay oh see okay so yeah so it seems that the reading for you is from here going from the right going to the left you see here it's related to the five of pentacles you were in a situation before where you were uh yeah you were unemployed you just lost your job and it made you financially insecure you were grasping for financial support no you you are unstable financially no uh, you didn't know you don't know what will happen to you and it made you feel constrained no uh, because uh, yeah the, the so i feel that you're because you have limited funds uh, somehow this came at in by it came as a surprise so you were not able to for some of you you were not able to make enough savings to to make you feel comfortable in this transit moment where you do not have a job so for some of you you are a little bit uh, uncertain financially economically and so you feel insecure you actually actually you have this feeling of nakedness feeling of not able to protect yourself uh, find a, a safe shelter it's like that there's a certain insecurity right now that you feel you no know, because of this being sent out and at the same time you feel limited in movement i think it is related to the financial constraint you no know? financial constraint when you are financial constraint you cannot move you cannot just buy what you want you have to budget things you cannot just go to a place where you want you no know? And it's a little bit difficult. It's like walking among swords. You no, know? you feel uneasy because yeah, there is a certain insecurity. But uh, beside it is this inspiration and with promises prosperity. And it seems that you are encouraged to go out into a journey because of this inspiration. And it promises here. You see here, there's an inspiration that promises that bloom here again. The inspiration, which is the sword, can be symbolizing this. This can be also a parallel to this seedling and it is promising you to progress no and here yeah in the near future it will be a progress and a loving relationship you are invited to set out on an adventure everything's going backwards no uh, but but this is this, this means that whatever you're going to do now it's not the contemporary thing so we will try to start to see here what is the message here okay you see here uh this is the knight of swords you see there's a light there and the sword is piercing it. It's as if the sword, or this is the tip of the sword and there is an inspiration. So I feel that the light symbolizes an inspiration. And uh, yeah, it is coming to you and it's coming to you like a sudden flash, coming to you very fast, this new inspiration, you no? Know? And uh, yeah, you see here, so it's going, the inspiration is beginning. You know how it is? suddenly i find myself like an ember you know a, a, okay uh, it's i the first thing i thought was it was a flash but i f kind of feel that it's like an ember uh it's like you know you are in a campfire where there is a fire and then after a while you lost the fuel it's like you lost financial support and then it's now sort of like a dying ember <laughs> Just like a dying ember, it's like a song, no? If you are listening to a song like that, it's like a dying ember. That something in my soul. Okay, uh, there's a song. If if you uh, it resonates with you, then maybe this is your song. No? So it's as if that in this after you lost your job, it's like a dying ember, but there's still an ember. And uh, yeah, you are having difficulty right now. This ember, I think, is the new inspiration that if you will nature, nurture, you know, even if the, it's an ember, if you take good care of the ember, you slightly blow into it. You no, know? blowing into it is like uh, gently caressing it. It's like nurturing it, nurturing the dream. You no, know? it will come back into life. It will come back into 
flame and i feel this is what is happening to you this ember is the inspiration that uh will make you out of this difficulty and you are carrying a big burden but you're coming out of the cave already so it's like here you are in a the house that you were sitting is like can symbolizes the work that you are in it's as if somehow you felt like you were in a cave and you felt was constrained but now that you are set out you are removed from the work you are coming out of the cave and you are going to start a new adventure and okay you will be faced with a lot of choices okay so as you start your adventure you will still be un undecided on what to do because you will be facing a lot of choices i mean uh, now that you are not committed to this job in the past no that has closed you will be facing with some choices but uh, and it will make you feel unsteady at first no but i feel that finally you will make a decision on which to choose and then you will put your sword down and then you will set out on the adventure of this new career that you will choose and it will lead to success in the future and here you see you will develop the skill of balancing things okay you see here in your journey you know uh, in your present career path there is an inspiration that is just like an ember and at this present time you are carrying a burden but this this ember if you take good care of it you will find yourself you will find your way out of the cave you know and for a while because of the decisions or the choices of the crisis you now you will feel uh, a little bit unsettled you no know? but there are choices here you might be a little bit troubled at first but there will be choices here and yeah for some of you you will have to try to balance things first you no know? you will try to balance things first and then but you will develop the skill the ability to balance and it will lead to success in the future so here you feel if you work on it you will develop the skills to balance things and uh, yes you see here the person moving so it's like moving to a new a new thing no so somehow this one you, you still do not know which to choose i think you will be able to make the right choice and you will be able to rebalance your life you know what we failed to see the main energy okay and here we do not have the insight oh hmm, interesting uh okay spirit maybe there's a reason why i failed to ask for a closing here and a closing here and a closing here so we will just add three more cards maybe the universe wanted us to have the story together yeah put them all together okay spirit could you please give us more message for us that we'll be able to use in the present challenges that we are encountering right now okay we have here heart opening you here you are closed you are protecting your heart okay beside it is heart opening someone you know it may even be you is withholding love and creating a very emotionally painful experience for everyone involved okay um, you need to you are in a defensive mode you need to slowly open up no so uh, you are closing your heart no someone you know or it may be even you is withholding love yeah you are insecure maybe you are hurt also in the process of recovering and creating a very emotionally painful experience for everyone involved so uh you need to get over this okay ask the universe to guide you uh pray Teach, ask the universe to teach you how to open up and love again boon heaven is rushing in and showering you with blessings open your heart to receive see open your heart let go of this these guards that you are putting off open your heart heart opening open your heart because the universe is coming to your aid okay i just said ask help from the universe well the universe is already waiting for you it's already opening up they're already responding even when you have not yet asked for the help they are already responding they are already giving you the assistance you need so uh come on don't hesitate ask the universe to help you open your heart okay and then finally we have wishing on a star okay it is time for you to dream again go ahead make a wish it just might come true so don't be afraid whatever it is now you're undergoing don't be afraid set off your sails make a wish make a dream don't be troubled already you are troubled here you couldn't make a decision couldn't begin you're still trying to balance no yeah this one is interiorly 
things are getting well already but interiorly you are a little bit delayed no here you're still carrying a burden there is this inspiration but you're still troubled and here you're still trying to make decisions still trying to make a balance it's as if the universe is saying wish on a star don't be afraid to dream reach out for your dream now and and ask for help the you open your heart because the universe already wants to help you uh, if there is this free will no even if the universe offers you a cup if you choose not to accept the cup then they cannot do anything it's a gift that is being offered to you so open yourself up to the universe okay uh, can we part with the last message for uh, Leo for July 2000 please spirit life force energy it is time to engage in activities that rejuvenate your mind body and soul. okay so try to be positive now try to think of activities like for example if you are feeling de uh, depressed and everything maybe some physical activities like yoga or some exercises or going jogging or walking in the park can help you regain a positive outlook you know? and maybe following your passion whatever this inspiration is you try to follow it put your heart and mind and soul into it and work on it no uh, regain your life force energy whatever the situation that happened I feel it has drained you of the energy it has drained you of your life force the universe is trying to replenish it you respond to the the, the universe is coming heaven is rushing in and showering you with blessings they are trying to give you energy again you open your heart to it welcome this new energy that is coming by participating by cooperating with the universe trying to do positive things that will uh, rejuvenate you again and help you regain your life force well leo that is your reading for the month of july 2022 please take what resonates with you and i hope this has been fruitful for you until next time have a great day